Yeah, man, if you run out to the keep it up with cash, you already know. And I was supposed to start vlogging days ago, but I didn't start. So I'm starting today. I am in. Y'all, I'm hungry. I'm eating. I'm out of town right now for a family event. And once I'm done eating, I'll tell y'all more about it because I'm hungry. I gotta eat. Okay, y'all. I am back. I just wanted to explain a little bit to y'all about the weekend. As y'all can see, I'm dressed. I'm ready. So, I'm at Massa McKinley Weekend. Um, a lot of y'all probably don't know what Massa McKinley Weekend is. But it's a big thing for Maslin in Canton. It's like a big, huge rival game. They go, like, all out, parades, all kind of stuff. They decorate the school. Everybody has a ball. Like, it's just a whole bunch of fun. Last night, me and my family, we went out to um, the Maslin versus McKinley party at the club. I was in the club with my mama, y'all, and my aunties and my uncles. So, but it was fun, and my cousins were there. We had a ball. And then today, we had breakfast. My uncle's birthday um, is actually lower. You people don't play. <laughs> no, um, but it's my uncle's birthday, so we're having him a surprise party. But nobody kept a secret, so it's not really a surprise anymore. So that's later on. But I'm walking into the game right now. And I don't know how long the game's going to be. Usually it's a few hours. We're at home this year. Last year we was at Paul Brown Stadium. But this year we at um, the high schools. We used to have a live tiger because the mascot is a tiger. But, you know, they changed it. We couldn't. After that Tiger King they was they would they could they said it was a humane so they don't do that anymore so i can't show y'all that but i'll just show y'all like the game and everything that's going on and then later just filming stuff but i was supposed to start vlogging last night so maybe i'll just put some clips in of last night and how it went and all the stuff that we did and when i get inside i will get back with y'all Funny Why my family got us in the visitor section? <laughs> I have no idea. So we on the other side with the other team. And you know it gets a little rowdy. Cause they a little rat shit. But I like rat shit. I like rat shit. I got these vinyl pants on, y'all. It's just a lot. It's a lot. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> it's hot, though. It is. It's very hot. Hey! Hey! Ooh, you got a bee by your head, girl. Let's see in a minute. I want to know what the controversy was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
So the game is over. We had left early because we was winning anyway. We was leaving, decided to leave early because we have to get ready for my uncle's birthday party. So we about to go over to the hall. I have to change because I just have like my Nirvana tee on, some vinyl pants and my bands and my selfie. So yeah, I'm about to go change into something more dressy for the party. I'm gonna have to fix this up a little bit. You look pretty. Thanks, girl, but I just still gotta fix it up. I'm gonna go get ready, do whatever we gotta do, do whatever's left. I don't think it's really a lot to do, but um, we gonna get it together. And when I get there, I will. Oh, I'm chewing this smack in this gum, y'all. It's gonna mess up my footage. Oh, well. When we get there, I will get back to y'all. Okay, y'all, so I'm about to try to get myself together. Things that, things that 
Yeah. When you look at your sibling, you be like, my brother did it, but you never done it. And like I said, you came back here and you showed us how to be four of us. And that's what mama has. She has four kids that she's put the glue together and you're the glue that holds it together. We love you. My dad is awesome. He has always been there for me and my kids. He's never meant to leave. And he's just a <clears throat> upstanding, outstanding man. Um, because of him, I've you know grown up to be the woman that I am. Uh, my work ethic is out of this world like him. He don't he knows he don't have to worry about me. Um, <laughs> he does not have to worry about me um, or my children, but uh, it's just been a blessing to have you as a dad. Years, I wish you 40 more. Thank you to Andre. And we just love you, and I, I hope you enjoy your surprise, not surprise birthday party. That's supposed to be a surprise, but somebody spilled the beans and told them. But I hope you enjoy your evening, and I hope God continues to bless you and have favor over your life. And I love you. Aww. Come on, little Jay, bring this home. Jeffrey. His uh, only son. Um, so I, I guess uh, didn't really have anything uh, prepared, but I guess piggybacking off of Rihanna. Um, sure, I don't really you know tell you this enough, but um, you know you're truly one of the, the most selfless, um, and hardworking you know men I know, um, and I think we can all agree with that. Um, you know, since we become a uh, housemates over the past few months, I know we uh, wanted to kill each other sometimes, but. Uh, <laughs> I want to say I, I love you and I truly appreciate everything that you know you do for me and um, providing for me and uh, making sure I'm set no matter what. Um, kind of always putting everyone else first um, above yourself. So I just want to say thank you. Yeah, right. I, I saved someone for last. She was acting like she didn't want to say anything, but we're gonna bring up the star of this real show that we have, and that is uh, Juanita. Come on up, mom. Come on. Hey everybody. First of all, I want to thank you all Talk for in it, coming. Nana. Hold it up. Hold it to your mouth. I want to thank you all for coming since they said I didn't have this mic up close enough to my mouth. Jeffrey, you are my firstborn. And I love you so much. There's nothing I know that you wouldn't do for me and your siblings, nieces, nephews, cousins, and everybody. We can call on you at the drop of a hat and you will be there. And I know sometimes, you be saying, I wish they stopped calling me. <laughs> <laughs> but just like they said, you are our glue. You are our number one thing that keeps us going. Without you, it wouldn't be us. I love you so much. You got my heart, and you always will. Oh, oh, did <laughs> <laughs> oh. And since I'm the MC, I can do surprises too, right? So, brother, I have found this poem, and the poem to me spoke uh, value. And the poem was written by Margaret Jones. I'm not going to take the credit for it, but it's called "My Brother, and My Friend." You're not just my brother, but also my friend. This birthday with you, I'm excited to spend. There's just a few things my heart needs to say. With you, a beautiful life. Wish you, wish you a beautiful life with each passing day. Whenever we needed you, you've always been there. Amongst our differences, because many of you didn't know that my, me and my brother wanted to fight all the time. Um, I was spoiled, I was a baby, he was the oldest, so it kind of came with the territory. Um, you still knew how to care. You shared, we've shared happy moments and even some tears. I'm really grateful for all of those years. It's not just a birthday. It's 
clearly much more. We'll celebrate you, who I truly adore. You're not just my brother, but also my friend. Big brother, my love and my thoughts, with joy I extend. I love you. Yes, Maya Angelou, I love it. Just get your black ass up here and give me a hug. <laughs> Nice today because you got some brew, huh? Yeah. So I had to give you how the shoe can real quick. Cause I'm about to put my vans on, y'all. My feet hurt. I'm on mom duty right now. Hey, I'm on mom duty. Hey, I'm on mom duty. Hey, I'm on mom duty. Hey, I'm on Because uh, oh girl, I'm gone. Because <laughs> <laughs> my cousin has seen y'all hey. to the ground. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday.
Hey, K-Bays, you are now tuned in to Keeping Up With K, if you already know. I am out at Liberty right now. I'm about to meet my mom for brunch. But of course, I'm late, so she's already waiting on me. Hey! This is my mom. It's a video. Sorry, I'm late. Oh, you look cute. Thanks. You look well rested. I slept good. I took my melatonin last night. Because <laughs> I got an extra hour. Yeah. Wax my zippers. Yeah, I don't know. I was thinking about pulling that one out last weekend, but it needs to be wiped off and cleaned out. I didn't feel like doing it. What you getting? Oh, you already got a um mojito. That sounds good, but I think I just want a plain old mimosa. Keep it simple. He said, well, you know I'm going to be asking you. Can you just stand by me? It just depends on who it is. So what you getting? The fried chicken. The fried chicken. The fried chicken sandwich. I wonder why she never came in high tonight. Cause she's weird. And I'm having chicken and waffles and some fries. That's cute. See, and it's November. Y'all see my mom's outfit in November. This is a shame. I should be bundled up out here listening with hot chocolate, listening to All I Want for Christmas is You. Cue the music. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. Okay, cue the summer music. I would like to get to know if you could be the kind of girl that you could be down for. Cause when I look at you, I feel so bad. I just got my fashion over shirt on. While well, my check this bag, <laughs> my leather pants, <laughs> just some little cheap little sneakers from fashion. But you can't do it. You look so cute. You're so humble. Thank you. We should probably cross because it's on the other side. So my mom gave me a bottle of wine. Because mine don't come out until, what is that, like the 15th or something? I don't know. Um, so she gave me one of hers. Um, and we were supposed to go wine tasting, but... Um, we're going voting today, but she's calling me right now. So once we get to where are we going, I'm going to um, call y'all back. So, y'all, I'm out here to vote with my mom. But the line is so long. I should have bought a jacket. Because mm -hmm. it's real cold underneath here. For real. Like. <laughs> she got her heels on to vote, y'all. <laughs> we gotta get in this long line. I'm gonna show y'all how long it is. Because, look. And you see how once we get in the line? I hope not, because I need a, uh, what you laughing at? Because I need a jacket. I'm feeling real cold. Oh my god. 
it just be so much people. How we get around here? We just walk through this way. We waited on my auntie though, y'all. Because she ain't here yet. She went to the grocery store. So we gotta wait on her. And when she get here, we just go save her spot in line. I think it's on that side, Ma. Okay, so this is the end of the line, y'all. So the line goes around here and it comes back around that way. So we're all the way at the end. We end up. I don't need to stand in the sun, Ma. I'm so cold. I'm so cold, y'all. I gotta stand in the sun. Like, I'm for real. Like, freezing cold. I should have brought my jacket. Because. I guess anemia, I don't know, but I'm cold. She, I think she calling my auntie. She just talking about. <laughs> I'm laughing at you, cause you said. So. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you where we are. <laughs> You gonna see it uh, once you do that? All you do we gonna be in the park a lot. You, you gonna see us? You gonna see them all here? All you gonna do is follow the line. Over there. <laughs> So it's daylight savings, y'all. And I slept like a baby, but now I want to go home and go to sleep. What time is it, mom? What time is it? Huh? What time is it? It's 2.29. What time do you think we're going to be out of here? <laughs> 4 o'clock. Oh, y'all. That means what? I ain't going to get home until... That means I'm not going to get home until... I don't know. Because then she got to drive me back to my car. Then I got to drive back home. So I'm going to be out for a while, y'all. You know, I just want to sit down. I don't want to go to work tomorrow. Do you want to go to work tomorrow? <laughs> yes, because I'm rested up. I don't want to go to work. I just need one more day. Because I'm well rested today. You'll be well rested tonight. <laughs> no, I want to be well rested. So then tomorrow, I can take a deep breath and not do nothing. And because you know, if we went out here, I wouldn't do nothing, I would have been at home doing nothing like I do on the weekend. Well, it's good to get out the house. So the line is starting to move a little bit, so we'll see in a minute what's gonna go, what's gonna happen, what's gonna, what's gonna go. So, who am I supposed to vote for? <laughs> Democrat. You're going Nan Whaley over Mike DeWine for governor. You're going all Democratic ticket. LaRonda Jackson, black black senator. You're going Tim Ryan. You're going all Democrat. Come on now. Oh, they got they got the picture and the what they are on it. Okay. I guess this is the important stuff. So. This is important. <laughs> okay. Well, y'all heard what she said. <laughs> I'm just the daughter. That's the mama. So I don't know. What but we about to just wait on my auntie because you know. So yeah, I got my list of who I'm supposed to be voting for. I guess it's everybody on this list. Say hey to my vlog. Hey. Ooh. Bitch your face. Okay, y'all, so we finally get like inside. We done went down like four escalators, went around, we done went over the hills, through the woods, all kind of stuff. <laughs> and we still ain't inside yet. To vote. <laughs> 
We still ain't in seven. We still no, we waiting. We still waiting. But I think we should be on our way. Yeah. Get that off of my face. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't like that. I want it to look cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, why are you got some gladiator glasses? <laughs> That's why I hit the camera. Because get that off of me. Yes, there we go. No, do it again. They got, they got stopped. Who? Did they get stopped? Who? Oh, they got, they're right there. They got stopped. <laughs> the lady stopped them. Um, they were sitting on the, um, they were sitting there. I'm filling their stuff out. So Nana ain't working the polls, huh? No. Nope. Uh -huh. How much she be getting paid for that? Like a hundred dollars? She get paid more than that because she, she elderly. The classes. Oh. One hundred and thirty-five. <laughs> she end up no. She end up once they get done. Mama get about two hundred something dollars because her, the classes they have to go to. Then the day of, and then she like she the wanted, second she's second like people to take the ballots back mm -hmm. to the. She don't get home until about 11, so yeah. she's coming. At night? Because mm -hmm. she has to drive with the, with the other person to take the balance. Mm -hmm. What time she start? Mm -hmm. What time she start? When they got to be there? She said, she I can hear it in her voice today. Well, how she much is that an hour? She Do it again. I don't like that. Y'all say the same stuff. My mom was out there giving me like an I have a dream speech for women outside. I said, you could have told me this in the car. And then she was like, no, because I got to tell you this. So, y'all are just when like. When the spirit moves you, you just got to go with it. Go well, the spirit have been moving through me. The spirit have been moving through me. I got a prayer journal. And I feel like my prayers get answered better in the journal. When you write it down. They do, and then when I when God answered Young my Jeffrey was asking how you was doing. Did he? Yes, baby. He was like, "What are you doing? Is she feeling bad?" Oh, he been sick. Why he asking about you? He been sick too. He got um. He got what's her name? Kobe no, or? He's not. He's just he just been sick. Time since time, we keep saying we think he needs to get out. You know, because he had bad sinus headaches and stuff. Mm -hmm. Well, I got a prayer journal, and I'll be writing down when God answered my prayers. I circle what I write. I circle what the prayer was, and I write the day that it's answered. So then, when I ever feel like my faith is going to waver, and like God ain't listening to me, I could be like, He listened to all these other days, so I know He got to hear me. So then, and then I got a manifestation book, and I be manifesting stuff, but I be trying to manifest in prayer because I was learning like online. It was telling me if you do manifestation, then it's like giving the credit to yourself and not giving credit to God. So then you say, okay, well I manifested this instead of saying, yes, God blessed me with this. So when I manifest, I be saying like instead of like. Thank you to the universe for aligning me to attract this. I'd be like, God, thank you for aligning me to attract X, Y, Z. And that's how I do it. So that's just a little hint into my manifestation life. If y'all want to manifest, maybe I'll do a video on that. What was the when is this from? This morning. Rimmer girl. Okay. So, um, soon enough. I will be voting, guys. Give me about how old am I? Fourteen. Give me you don't know four you more years, and then I'll be out here voting. Do you voting. have an ID yet? No. I'll have my temps in twelve months. Some unknown caller. Anyways, I'll have my temps in twelve months, guys. Um, 
after my birthday, I'm gonna get my temps. And then I'll be cruising down the street in my six phone. Um, yeah, that's it. Those old school, old school cars that bump. Like that. <laughs> you be like watching too much straight out of Compton. Make your candidate selection. Be sure to touch the center of the candidate's name on the screen. Just okay. like that, all right? Okay. Yep. She's been watching too much straight out of coffee. Jacking them. Slapping them. So they put us in. Okay, they gonna put us out here. <laughs> what you say? Well, I'm saying it again for the camera. <laughs> oh, shoot. So I'm done voting. We got to keep our, our city grooming. I got my sticker. How do you feel after voting? Wonderful. Wonderful. <laughs> How do Sister you feel girl voting? I feel great. Um, Sister girl. I loved voting so much. So it's time to go. I got a free pen. Even though my tax is probably going to go out, but I voted. I voted for the trial. I did three, but y'all know I'm probably moving to DC anyway. So and it's clear. <laughs> it's okay. So yeah, y'all, I got to tell y'all. I'm probably gonna be moving to DC next year because I'm trying to get back into school again. I'm trying to get this PhD. I'm trying to be Dr. Hicks. So how do you feel about me moving to DC, Ma? How you feel about me moving to DC? We'll see when it happens. <laughs> She's saying it like I'm not gonna do it. Like I haven't got up and gone. For real. Is, girl, run out there. <laughs> it just fall out. Uh, we can walk out. <laughs> it's a business, girl. Oh, okay. Bye. I love y'all. I didn't get to hear how Aunt Brandy felt about me moving to DC. You think I'm not gonna do it? You said you weren't gonna do it. I said, let's wait and see what happens. Do you think DC would be a good place for me to go? It's young people there. So, yes. It's black people there, <laughs> too, right? Yeah. Ain't DC a black city? Yes, it is. I got a friend there, so I won't be alone. And it's not that far from home. You can drive to come see me. We've been to D. We drove to DC before. I fly to DC. Oh, you fly? <laughs> yeah. Well, I am going. I'm going to the DMV area, God willing. <laughs> we ain't this far. Still up. <laughs> but we wasn't up that high going outside. What time is it, Ma? Like, is it, was we on, did no, we say the time? 30. Oh, we actually 30 minutes ahead of when we thought. That was actually pretty quick. Yeah. Quicker than I thought it was going to be. It only took up one hour, y'all. Yeah. Looking pretty good for us. Yep. The Republicans looking sad on that side. <laughs> yeah, it's a little dead over there. <laughs> That was a little sad on your brother. Yeah. Sorry, no shade to any Republicans on my blog. I love everybody. I don't discuss politics. We just saying. Now my mom is about to take me back to your car. My car. Because we left my car out in the outlets by Cincinnati. So we got here quick though, too. Yeah. Um, we about to go back and then I'm gonna drive my car home. And but you know, I'm y'all. I'm right by my house, so I won't have a far drive back home. Right, I do. I have 40 minutes. Cause y'all know I live in Cincinnati, so. Okay, so I just washed my makeup off my face as good as I could outside of the shower. But I'm about to get in the shower. And then I'm about to chill and go to bed, y'all. I just wanted to close the end of this day out because, look, honey, I am tired. When I say I am so tired, y'all, like, because I would usually be in bed by this time. So I'm really tired. I got up today at like six. I didn't even sleep in really. Um, I got up like super early, but 
Um, yeah, I'm about to get into the shower. I changed my shower curtain, y'all. It's actually pretty cute. So, um, yeah, I'm about to get into the shower. I keep telling y'all the same thing over and over. So, I guess that is the end of this vlog for today. I don't know if I will, um, close this out to the weekend. I probably won't do any vlogging this week. I don't really like to vlog during the week. Because I don't be doing that, y'all, but chilling. I literally just be chilling. So, um... We'll see. If anything happens, you know, I'm going to cut the camera on. But if not, then I will see y'all this weekend. I can hopefully have my Sunday back this week. So, we will see. If I don't vlog on this week, then I will vlog this weekend. And I will see y'all later. So, y'all didn't really realize how long this vlog was. So, I'm going to just stop here and I'm going to save the rest of the footage for the next vlog so like i said that's all that i have for you today and i will see you later